So this sneaker release came out October 18, on Wednesday, and it's the Jordan 1 Satin Bread colorway. And I was really excited about this pair when I found out about it and knowing that the materials are mostly satin. Pretty much, I was really excited. Um, I think the shine of them is super clean and very nice. Um, people have called it pretty fancy, which it is. So, I laced up my pair. And hopefully you can kind of tell, like, that satin material. I love how the swoosh is kind of like, almost like a patch a patch swoosh you know because of the kind of like this line borders the swoosh I laced them up like this and I wanted to show off the lace tips the laces are black and the tips are silver with the Jumpman logo on there these are really clean. Even the tongue is satin, which is super nice. It's the toe area. And then these are the bottoms. These are just so clean. I'm really excited about these. I don't really wear red much, but I've mentioned this before, I think, but um, I do love the color. It's really nice. And there's the insole. I don't know if you can see. There we go. And this is in women's sizes. And it being a women's edition, they all they each come with a tote bag. Red jump man with black, red and black. It's cool, like people have put the shoes in there and stuff, <laughs> which is really nice. Gotta love the extras that come with it. They also come with the extra set of laces. So the laces are red, comes in this box. Also has silver tips with the Jumpman logo on there. And if you kind of want to see or compare the color with the satin, there it is. So it seems like the, honestly, it seems like the laces are a little bit more crimson or a little bit of a darker red, at least in person. And definitely in person, these kicks are super super nice you know a fun fact is uh, the uh, red of the of this colorway reminds me of when I went to Circus Circus in Reno and it was with I was with my family and I was a child really young and there were these there was this game where you had to put a bowling ball, roll a bowling ball, and the bowling ball had to go back and forth and not go, like, stop at the end. And if you succeeded, you could win a red, a bull, oh, no, it's a bulldog <laughs> that's red. And it was a super cute stuffed toy. I always wanted it when I was there, but the game was so hard that it didn't happen, so. <laughs> but yeah, the... <laughs> Randomly, the this color reminds me of that stuffed toy. <laughs> and I love stuffed toys, so. Anyway. Uh, yes, so these are super nice. I will definitely wear them. I might actually wait until December because um, I know that sounds a little bit silly, right? But just been wearing them at home. I want to keep them in pristine condition as I can in a sense um at least with the creasing but I know that's gonna happen eventually 
And I'm one of those people though that I do love to wear my sneakers. I don't just like collect them and then let them kind of sit there or be displayed. I enjoy wearing my sneakers because I do think the point is to, mainly the point is to sport them. But I, I get that if you do have like a collector's shoe that you want to keep them in the box. But, and then here is the box. And yeah, I was really lucky to get a pair of these. Um, I was kind of worried that like getting it on the apps or either online, it was pretty tricky. Um, but I feel like they've kind of stocked up with these. Like they put some in stock again and or something and maybe they got like a second batch that they have available for people, which is really nice. And yeah, I'm really excited to wear these. And two, I think that these are going to be one of my favorite Jordan 1s and just one of my favorite sneakers ever. So I'm really excited about these. And I do think they're fairly comfy. I don't know how comfy they are when you wear them for longer periods of time, but I think they're really nice. I'm really excited for these. And I do have a couple of like satin pieces of clothing, but one of them that I wanted to share was my Pittsburgh Steelers jacket. It's satin, so I'll probably sport it with this at some point. I know Steelers fan right here. Ever since I was a child, I chose a Steelers jersey and that's just where it went from there. <laughs> Even though I'm not from Pittsburgh, I... I'm a fan, so Steelers fan, so you can see that shine a little bit. Maybe not really from the jacket, but it's there. <laughs> I'm really excited to wear these, but I, like I said, I might just wait until December because Christmas, one of the colors being red. So yeah, and we'll probably wear it to church first because that's kind of what I do for a certain for. A good chunk of my sneakers that I wear. Um, I wear them for the first time outside going to church. So I just feel like it's a uh, makes it more special in a sense. All right. This is more like an after thought video or in continuation of my previous segments. But one of the things I forgot to mention about these were that it feels like the inside of the sneakers, it's very cushiony, awfully cushiony. And I think it's because of the materials that they have, definitely the satin being there and everything. So I just wanted to mention that and I'm sporting my Satin Steelers hoodie, I mean, not hoodie, jacket. So 
just wanted to mention that. All right, here we go.